all right so first thing you need to do is click on the create new bar meanwhile i have opened this door uh, you can see that right now there is no bar uh, on the top so uh, once you click on create new bar you'll see a uh, basic template options you need to choose one of the template that uh, matches to your current shopify themes you know something like a similar color or contradicting color whatever your choice is so for the example let's go with full spring or oh, let me go with uh, something with light color fairy tale okay this one's look good and once you've done that then you will see a preview and after that there is one box called content configuration here first of all you need to mention the free shipping goal that means this is the amount that uh, your potential customer will add to cart before uh, he would be able to sh uh, see the free shipping uh, code free shipping uh, coupon code so for that what you can do is you can choose any desired amount that you want in my example i'll make it like uh, 30 dollars all right and your initial message is this is the first part of the message like what you want uh, them to see so i can uh, leave it like this free shipping on orders over and then the amount ignore this amount okay this is just a demo amount here after that next is free shipping goal that means uh, like when suppose uh, i'm offering 30 dollars uh sh free shipping only when 30 dollars stuff is added so in case if, if customer has added only 29 dollars stuff then you need to show him the message that how much amount is left before he can get free shipping so for that we can uh say like just six dollars left for free shipping you can see how the message is gonna look on the bar second bar and the finally is the message where you need to uh, show the coupon code for free shipping that your user can enter on the checkout page and to get the free shipping. So one thing that you need to remember is that in the discount section, you need to go and create a shipping discount. That means you need to go and create a coupon uh, that offers free shipping on this amount that you're mentioning here. And then you copy that coupon code and paste it into the goal achieved message. For example, congratulations, you have got a free shipping or I can make it like awesome awesome here's your free shipping code uh let's say awesome 20 is my code all right so this is the message you'll see once he add all the products uh, uh at least for 30 dollars and then you can change two text this is the text color for now i'll keep it uh, black is okay to me and this is special text special text color is basically the dollar uh, um, the amount color i'll show you how it's gonna look for now let me have it make it something green all right and once you're happy with the settings with the font size and paddings and etc you can click on save and okay so the bar the free shipping bar is created successfully now you need to click on active to enable it make sure you don't skip this part okay all right, so it's done. Now we are going to go back to the store and click on refresh. Wait for a few seconds for it to load. All right. Cool. Here you can see it. Free shipping on orders over $30, right? So now, uh for example uh your customer come and added something like this is 99 dollars so let me just go ahead and open this product and i'm gonna click on buy it now so once i do that just wait for a while Cool, because uh, currently my settings is like sending them direct to checkout. But if I go back to the store, you can see it's a message, uh, the new message for the shipping is popped up. Awesome, here's your free shipping code, awesome20. Because uh, the client has added more than $30, you can see the message is there. But if I go back to the cart, uh, for example, like this, 
and remove the product. You can see this is changed to free shipping on orders because uh, there is no product and it doesn't uh, cross the limitation of $30. There is no coupon code. So this way you can simply mention whatever amount you want into the settings and then click on activate. So customer psychologically customer would want to add uh, the more amount, the more price item so that he can get free shipping or any kind of offer that you want. You can offer discounts. If you don't want to offer free shipping, you can offer discount code, you know, something like add uh, $50 worth of product and get 10% off. So once he added the $50 worth of product, then you can show a 10% off coupon. So for that, make sure you go, go to the discount settings and create. Let me show you. Go to the discount, click on create discount, and you can go with discount code. Okay, and here you can make like uh, the one I've done is awesome 20. And let's say it's free shipping, simple, all countries, everything. Minimum purchase amount, make sure you change it to $30. Right? Everyone, everything, everything looks perfect and then click on save discount code. So now when uh, the customer will add it $30, it will be a free shipping, he will see this coupon code. So it's so easy to use that. That's all in this video. If you have any question, you can see a small uh, green icon on the bottom right side. You can click on that and contact the support. This is a free app, enjoy your app, and for questions, let me know. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day, bye-bye.